Fantasy Club EPL. Oh, baby, we made it. It is game week 34. We got double dip in action for Leicester City, Chelsea, Tottenham, Burnley, Brighton, Manchester United, Southampton, and Bournemouth players. Hell yeah. So it is time to use that free hit or the wild card <laughs> and load up on players from those teams. But remember, there is FA Cup action, so some of the lads could be rested in the second matches for those teams. It can't be. Can it? Or is your entire world just crashing down all around you? All right, that's enough. Yeah. So let's get to it. Here are three players that you should get. Number one, here is a sleeper for your defense this week. Burnley's Steven Ward. It's a double game week for the Clarets. And this is how it'll go down. On Saturday, Burnley will get a good result at home against Leicester, and Ward will get you some points. Then on Thursday, Burnley go again at home, but against Chelsea, and they're 100% focused on their FA Cup semifinal against Southampton. Hey, you're breaking my concentration. You're distracting me. That's only three days later. So, Burnley will capture another famous scalp this season, and Ward will score you some more points. Points! Number two, Glenn Murray. What? A cheap forward option at only six pounds. Brighton's Glenn Murray could have a massive FPL week with matches against 17th place Crystal Palace and a home game against the Spurs side that will also be focused on their own FA Cup semifinal. You gotta get it together. Focus, focus, focus. Nobody expected the 34-year-old to reach double figures this season, but he's sitting on 11 goals, and shit, he might reach 15 by the end of this week. I didn't think he had it in him. I know, right? <laughs> and lastly, our third player, Ryan Frazier, a double game week for Bournemouth players, is soured by the fact that they have to play Liverpool and Manchester United. We're fucked, Walter. Nothing is fucked. Dude, come on, you're being very on dude. However, Liverpool will have a nasty European hangover and United will be preparing for Spurs in the FA Cup. Scottish winger Ryan Fraser is another cheap option who could score 10 plus total points over the course of the week. Oh yeah! Time for our GTFO, you will not believe it. We are choosing Mohamed Salah here. Why would you drop the man tied with Lionel Messi in the European golden boot race? Am I hallucinating here? Just what in the hell do you think you're doing? Two reasons. Numero uno, Liverpool only play once this week, while eight other clubs have the double game week. Second, Salah wasn't even risked against Everton last weekend because of his groin injury. And following Tuesday's Champions League quarterfinal in the second leg against City, he could be given more time off against Bournemouth on Saturday. Get out! Read it. It says, take a vacation from my problems. Now it is time for the all-important captain's choice. It is very crucial because we have the double game week. Jamie Vardy is our choice. Liverpool, Manchester City, and Arsenal only play once in game week 34. So the obvious choice for a captain would be what? An attacker from Spurs, Manchester United, or Chelsea, who all play twice? No, no, no. <laughs> Those sides also look ahead to their FA Cup semifinals. So when selecting players, our choice is Leicester's Jamie Vardy. My captain. My king. The Foxes have a double game week as well, and they're playing winnable matches against Burnley and Southampton. Vardy has scored in three straight matches, and we're back in that that streak hits five. Boom! Enjoy the long game week, folks. That's all we got. It doesn't end until Thursday. Will Manchester City wrap up the Prem after their debacle against Manchester United? We think yes. Adios. Bye-bye!